patients who walk into my clinic having shown in some other place or some other center and say, Doc, I am not fit for LASIK and I don't want to wear glasses. So what do we do? We have two technologies available with us. One is with the laser, which is called as PRK. And the other one is a phakic lens, where we implant a lens in the eye, which does not have to be changed or taken out, and which takes care of, takes care of the spectacle power. So let's first talk about PRK, or photorefractive keratotomy, which is done with the laser machine. The technique we have with us is Streamlight, with or without Contura, in which there is no cut, there is no touch, there is no pain, and it takes gets rid of the power in even thin corneas. So this is possible, and we select the patients of thin corneas for this treatment, but we can do only up to a spectacle number of maybe seven or eight. We cannot do it for numbers which are higher than eight. Even seven or eight, sometimes in some situations, if the cornea is not adequate, we would not wish to do this technique. But if your eye is fit for it, it is one of the safest laser corrective procedure with Contura that we can do. Suppose your power is 10 or 11, or even six or seven, but it is not fit for PRK. And you do not want to wear spectacles or contact lenses. What we have is phakic lenses. Phakic means with our own lens still in the eye, not like a cataract surgery where we remove our own lens. So in a phakic lens, we have Indian and we have imported ones. It is a fully reversible procedure the lens is implanted in the eye and very important, if at all there is a problem, in a five minute surgical procedure, it can be taken out. But as yet, I have not had to remove any lens of any of my patients once it is done. The reason being that we are very, very careful of the workup. That means the selection of which patient is going to do well with it, for which we have fixed criteria, fixed measurements, and fixed diagnostic equipment with which we do all these tests. Once this workup is done, with the help of the IOL Master 700, which we have, anterior segment OCT, which we have of Carl Zeiss, with the help of gonioscopy to see the angles and also measurements with vernier caliper, we take a call whether they are fit for a fake lens or not. Then it is the calculations of what lens to be ordered, whether the patient has a cylindrical power or it is a non-toric lens where there is no cylindrical power and the costing would depend on that. Trust me, speak to our patients. These are our happiest patients. Hope to answer your question of what do I do if I'm not fit for LASIK and I don't want to wear glasses or spectacles. Thank you.